What would you say to somebody who calls you a climate change hero? That's awkward. <laughs> How can I get everything I need from pollution? Back in 2015, the NRG Cosia Carbon X Prize was launched as a $20 million prize. And today, there are just 10 finalists left. It's the most important chemical you've never heard of and use every day, making everything from cars to shampoo to mattresses. Ethylene, it's the gift that keeps on giving. It's really like the base building block for so many different things that you use every day. But there is a snag. It takes fossil fuels, such as natural gas, to produce the 158 million tons of ethylene we use every year. But what if we could still make it, not only without fossil fuels, but in a way that produced much less CO2? It's the most widely used petrochemical in the world right now. We just want to make it from CO2 instead. Meet Team Cert from Toronto, Canada. This brainy bunch have figured out a way to make this amazingly versatile chemical from just CO2, water, and electricity. Our ethylene that we produce from CO2 is like chemically identical to the ethylene that's produced from fossil fuels. Waste CO2 is captured from a nearby source. It is then fed, along with renewable electricity and water, into a special electrocatalyst that transforms the CO2 molecule and reforms into a different chemical, such as ethylene. Our ethylene actually goes out into this. For the average person, I hope it means that they're able to you know, still enjoy and use the products that they use every day, but feel better about the fact that we can recycle that ethylene through our process. We definitely feel like underdogs. Our technology is relatively new. It's better to be underestimated and prove people wrong than uh, to be overestimated and fall short.